Hey you all, I want to start with saying, I know, I know, I'm sitting uncomfortably close to the camera right now, but that is because that is the only way it'll focus, and even like that, it's barely focusing, the focus will probably shift in and out, I am on the hunt to get a new camera as soon as possible, because it's been impossible to film videos. So this might be the last video I'm filming on this camera which I'm not too sad about. I really need a new one. This camera has lived a long, happy, fulfilling, meaningful life and I'm very grateful for it, but it's not working anymore. Anyways, that is not what this video is about today. Today, I am announcing the winning book for the book club and I'm so beyond excited for that and I'm so happy that you all dropped your book suggestions yesterday and the day before and I'm so grateful for everyone who took their time to vote on their favorite book. And we now have a winner and the winner is the book that I suggested which is Steppenwolf by Herman Hesse and it was pretty close with the book 1984 by George Orwell. I really wanted to read that book for a while so maybe that will be the winning one for August, who knows. But not for July. This is the book for July and I will briefly be reading to you about the author and about the book. And I'll be reading off of my computer and hopefully I am in focus right now. It doesn't look like it, does it? Hopefully we can just get through this video because I really want to get this video out today. Okay. Hermann Hesse is a German novelist and poet who was awarded the Nobel Prize for Literature in 1946. The main theme of his work is the individual's effort to break out of the established modes of civilization so as to find an essential spirit and identity. Now about the book. Steppenwolf is a poetical self-portrait of a man who felt himself to be half human and half wolf. His Faust-like and magical story is evidence of Hesse's searching philosophy and extraordinary sense of humanity as he tells of the humanization of a middle-aged misanthrope. Yet his novel can also be seen as a plea of rigorous self-examination and an incentment of the intellectual hypocrisy of the period. As Hesse himself remarked, Of all my books, Steppenwolf is the one that was more often and more violently misunderstood than any of the others. And the reason I suggested, suggested, I'm struggling with that word, suggested that book is because ever since I read Stoner by John Williams, I have been craving more fiction, philosophical fiction, ish and this book has been on my list for some time but because I wasn't really reading any fiction for a long time I just really couldn't get myself to go and get it but now that I am craving more fiction in my life I figured this would be the perfect book for us to read together so how this will work is hopefully as many of you all will want to join us to read in July. So you just simply get your book, you can purchase it or you can go to your local library or you can get it on Audible for free. I believe they have 30 days for free and we will be reading, well, starting July 1st, but obviously you can start as soon as you get the book and we will be reading until the end of July. And throughout the month, y'all can come back to this video in particular to share your thoughts and your opinions and, you know, anything that can come to mind while you're reading the book and discuss with others. And I really hope y'all will be actively coming back to this video and just sharing your thoughts and discussing with others. That's really what book clubs are about, just chatting and getting new ideas and getting your own ideas out. So um, obviously I'll also be leaving my thoughts and comments 
here on this video throughout the month. I might sporadically share some of my thoughts on the book on Instagram throughout the month, um, just because it's a quick way to just throw up a video on my story of something that I'm thinking about. And um, maybe keep in mind to try and warn about spoilers, so maybe write what page you're on before writing your thoughts, and that way someone who hasn't read that far yet uh, will not be bummed because you spoiled something for them. Again, I'm so so sorry for this video quality and the focus not focusing at all. That's it. I'm very excited. Uh, please comment if you are joining the book club. Please comment if you're thinking of getting the book and what your thoughts are on the book. Uh, like I said, I'm thrilled to start reading with you all because I've been reading alone for, you know, my entire life, except for in school, you know, when you were forced to read with class. But... I've never done anything like this, and I'm so excited to not having to read alone anymore. And I hope you all are just as excited, and I'm going to be getting my book as soon as I'm home, because I am uh, in northern Sweden right now, so I'll be going home today, actually, and get my hands on it. So I'm trying to think if I've forgotten anything important. Um, check the information box or description box in case I've forgotten to mention anything important. And like I said, we might get something, a different format in the future, depending on how engaging you all are. I might get a website, an app, a Discord group, a subreddit, but I think we'll start like this in July, just to so I can get an idea of how, how uh, active you all are and see if it's, uh, if it's going to be worth doing that. Hopefully it will. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one hopefully with a new camera. Fingers crossed, bear with me, I am working on it. Thank you, I'll see you in my next one.